America is the Backstreet Boys. And as they're away from home, I thought I'd find them a little bit of stateside over here in the Fallen Alley to see if they can strike it lucky. Just to be close to you. Just to be close. The beginning of the video is going to be like a, a disco ball that explodes. The stage we're performing on is a lot like this table. It's round and it revolves. And there's like a wall of fans surrounding us and below us. And everything. Tony raps in it and he's flying. He's like flying in the air. It kind of rates up there with the we got it going on kind of feel. It was criticized for sounding a bit like m and I've got a little something for you. Yeah. What did you feel about that? I didn't even know about there being another group that had the same type of sound. Because we first came over here, we hadn't even heard it. When we finally saw the song, and we're like, well, it does kind of sound a little bit like you. But, but it wasn't any intention. Or no, it, it was kind of a shock to us. We didn't realize there were so many, you know, other boy groups out here. So, who are the winners? Well, here they are. Backstreet Boys with I'll Never Break Your Heart. Smash it award. Oh, it's really cool. The, the feeling of them, I mean, people cheering for you just it moved me really and choked me up a little bit. I was like, wow. Would you consider yourselves to be a boy band? No. A vocal harmony. No. No. Sometimes it's hard to um, have an up tempo song with some fat harmonies in it. Fat good harmonies. I don't know if you guys are down with that, but um, good harmonies in it, you know, to showcase our vocal. R&B vocals is, you know, kind of the way we've modeled ourselves after groups like, you know, Boys to Men. Had her hair blonde now. She was really good. You ever heard of a girl named Christina Ritchie? Louise. You're from England. All the girls from TLC. Pretty nice. Hi, this is D Rock. Hi, this is Ken.